this is Sparkle, and I thought I'd do an updated version of Get to Know Me. Because as years change, yeah, you change too. So, as you can see, I like dark colors. So, yeah, I went with, I, I'm loving darks. Um, also, I'm loving wigs more than I used to ever before. So, yes, I love those. Um, also, I am loving, um, this new little app that I uh, was told by, by, um, a lady here on YouTube, uh, BBW Sweet and Sexy, and it was really cool how she had told us about this. You now, oh my God, I have yet to use it, yet to use it. I said I was going to. So, uh, I like going on, I, I went on there a couple times, like, yeah, literally two. And, uh, because it said she was going to be on there. And I, like, got over there and see what it was like. And it's awesome. Yeah. Y'all might want to check that out. So, I'm thinking I'm going to try to dabble that way. So, if you're interested, um, let me know if you want to go over there with me. Because I don't want to go over there and be by myself. You know, but I think it's only, like, two, three people. I don't know where they came from. Bless you. I appreciate you. That wants to follow me over there. So, hey. I appreciate it. I think they saw me when I was talking to BBW Sweet and Sexy. So, um, that's probably where they came from. But you just never know. But I think that's a cool thing. So, I love that. Um, if you haven't checked me out or befriended me on Facebook, go over and do that. Because I love going over there. Uh, this last week or so, I haven't really been over there. But I'm going to go over there and I'm going to check it out. So, I'm not sending you over there to a phantom thing. So, I like that. Um, let me see what else I like. I just found out that I like purple. I didn't know I like purple. That's new to me. I like purple. So, I went with that. I like anything with Paris on it. Uh, you know I love Marilyn Monroe. Just love Marilyn. So, that. And then... From my uh, vlog that I, you guys, I, mean, I thought I shared with you guys that I love, love, love Audrey Hepburn. Hepburn. Oh, can't even talk. Audrey Hepburn. So, love her. Um, totally addicted to shoes. Um, went to a party that I gave to my spouse. And, oh my God, I love karaoke. <laughs> I love karaoke. I'll be singing. Now, I don't know if I can sing. But I was singing. I mean, I was told, this is not your birthday. But, hey, I'm going to sing. Everybody had a great time. And I remembered and relearned I love to bowl. Love to bowl. Yeah. I got a couple strikes. <laughs> yeah, I did. And, um. All I know is she was hating on me. <laughs> nah, she was. <laughs> she was playing, but I had a great time. Had a great time bowling. Um, what also I found out about myself that I just can't believe it is I do not do not gasp. Okay, because I know some of y'all finna gasp. But I found out I do not like seafood. I don't like seafood. I'll eat some, like I may eat a little catfish or cod or I want to eat salmon, but I'm allergic. Yeah, I know. I can't eat it. It will just literally kill me. Literally. But I love how it tastes, but I don't mess with it. When I found out that I wasn't supposed to eat it, I must have messed with it one more time and it like almost like took me to a whole nother level. So, um, shrimp is okay. I don't. I can go with it without it. Mostly without it. Uh, but I don't like seafood. Mm -mm. But I, I, but my spouse does. And I don't begrudge them to go to like Red Lobster or whatever. All shucks and all them other little seafood places. I just get me some fish and I let them do what they're going to do because they love crabs and all that stuff. I do I don't like the smell. I don't, I don't like no parts of it. And no, I'm not pregnant. <laughs> I just don't care for it. I found that out. Um, another thing that I discovered, which was a shocker to me, is I like Kendrick Lamar. Oh my God. I thought 
I didn't like nothing new. I love, I, I love his music. Love, 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 love his music. Uh, I don't know if you guys know also that I am a big fan of Pink's. Yeah, I like all types of music, like for real, like all, all types. Um, then uh, what else was that? Of course, I love Usher. I have always loved Usher, but right now I'm loving Usher more than ever. But who I am it. It will shock some people. I am literally infatuated with. Could not live without. Even though he's a bad boy. Oh my God, I'm loving a bad boy. Uh, what is my what would my mama say? But anyway, I am loving. I love everything this guy do. Everything, and I know he bad for me, <laughs> but I love him. Chris Brown. Oh my God, that little thing right there. I'm not a cougar, okay? Let's get that straight. I don't want him for that. But his music is incredible. This boy, everything he touch, turn to gold. I mean, y'all, I'm not playing. You don't believe me? Look at my uh viewings that I be doing, the stuff I be looking at, and you'll see I'm always looking at some Chris Brown. I click on things that Chris, 50 videos of Chris Brown, you got me all night long, just like Lionel Richie. I am right there. I am loving, like, loving, loving, loving Chris Brown. I remember when he was younger, I kind of liked his music, but it was, but this last couple years, Chris, you, you on fleek. Like, for real, I'm just loving it, like, the whole thing. Um, who else? It, it was so mean. I just found out, you know, I'm not really a Mick, Nicki Minaj fan. You can touch it just a little bit with her. Um. I don't know what that is. But who I am. I am a Tay Martian for life. I've been loving Tamar way before she had blew all the way up. When she was on, you know, Braxton's family. And I'm here to tell you. She was still in the show all over the place. And I love me some Tamar. I watch. I mean. I watch The Real. Because she is everything. Everything. Baby, everything. I don't care from head to the toe, girl. You do that. You do that. Mm, mm, mm. Tamar, I love you. And if you don't like it, that's fine, but I do. I mean, she all that to me. Keep doing what you're doing, girl. Because everybody got some haters. And it's all good. And I'm, I'm down for you. You know, that's how it go. Uh, there's some people on YouTube that I find that I like. I'm not going to lose a list because I never thought that we would mesh, but I like them. And they're not in the beauty community, so don't go thinking you're going to see them. Well, they're just different ones. Uh, also, I found out that I don't like straight hair. Mm -mm. I like it for, only thing I like is I can curl it. But to just be straight, I don't like straight hair. I can't believe that. So, I don't, don't anticipate seeing me with no straight hair. Because if it do, I'm going to curl it, bump it, twist it. Just straight bone. I don't, I don't like it. I, didn't, I don't understand why. Now, that's some things I found out about myself. Let me see. I don't want this to be too long. Let me see. I'm at eight minutes. Um, what else did I found out new about myself? I found out that I like myself a lot more than I used to. Um, although I would like to get rid of this thing, you know, they call the tire, the little weight around you, you know, the little, that ain't cute. Uh, I would like to get rid of that. But what was shocking is I'm not ashamed of the little flap. No. I'm going to throw that out there. I don't know what y'all worried about. I, I already know. A Michelle Obama, I will never be. She got her hair is nice and tight. It's not going to happen. I'm embracing this. Um... I did something a couple weeks ago. I just can't believe. And I'm finna, I can't believe I'm going to tell y'all, but I did it. I stood in a full-length mirror, mirror. Yeah, like stock naked. Like the day I was born. Mm-hmm. Did that. Did I like it? Heck no. But I embraced some things. I encourage you to do the same thing. Just get in there and just look at it. Turn around. Flip it. Twist it. Look at it. Embrace it. And if you don't like it, just start working on it. Because... It is what it is. I mean, like, I just couldn't believe, like, I really got to get into this. It's all because that dang 600 pound life, they is killing me. They got me thinking I'm going to be anorexic real soon. And then on top of that, I done messed up on my hula. Yeah, pray for me, y'all. And then found this uh show from across the sea. It's in, um, 
What they say they was at? Oh, I can't remember right now. I'll probably post it right here. But anyway, the UK. That's what it was. And they have, like, they say they are the second fattest uh, country. You know we the first. Yeah, USA. Don't act like y'all didn't know. They say they're the second one. Anyway, they have a show called, don't, don't take this wrong, because that's the name of it. It's called Fat Doctor. Yeah, that's what I said. F-A-T, not F-H-A-T. <laughs> but Fat Doctor. And over there, I'm okay. 600 pound life and them i don't know which one is worse i i i, I don't know because they both got me scared like for real y'all i'm like i know i'm not unhealthy because i don't i'm not on any medication and i don't know how to run to no doctor and all that stuff and i got a high blood pressure and high cholesterol all that other stuff ain't none of that happened thank you lord whoo thank you lord but that's some scary stuff y'all Y'all know I ain't got no business watching that stuff. And my baby told me, you need to stop. Because <laughs> you're killing me. But it is messing up my, my dome. It's messing with my dome. So, I found out that, yeah, I'm scared to get bigger. Mm. Mm, no. I, I don't know. I, I ain't going to lie to y'all. It, it, it probably be sometimes soon I'm hot down and join the gym. And you know why. Because I just told you why. I'm just saying. I'm just going to tone some stuff up. You know. Kind of mastermind it. I ain't gonna do nothing too crazy. Okay, so, but I did good because from over the winter, you know how you used to get fluffier in the winter? Okay, well, I didn't do that. I went from the winter, I wore a size 26 this winter, and this spring, I am a strong 22. And I even bought a pair of jeans with a size 20. Yeah, get your life. And no, it ain't lies you tell, it's the real deal. I can show them to you. So I did that, but it ain't strong. Like, I still got some 24s that I can kind of get into, but it's got, like, kind of, uh, loose. So, I gotta go jean shopping. Yeah, I already told my homies, we gotta get together, we gotta go jean shopping, because I gotta get some new jeans, because this ain't working. So, that happened. Um, what else then changed in my life? Still married to the same person. Yeah, that didn't change. Um, ooh. I got a child getting ready to graduate in June. I got one down. Now I got to have two down and one to go. Woo! Keep praying for me. It's all about to happen. And let's see what else I got. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, also, also, before I forget, I, I found out that I like brighter colors i usually wouldn't wear brighter colors but i like brighter colors like some oranges some yellow i mean yellow and like teal greens and deep greens i ain't even never like green but i found out i'm beginning to like greens so that's happening um also what else oh somebody made this dish for me what was it what was it what was it? uh and i can't remember what it was oh it's got a tater tot casserole. At first, I had my nose up. <laughs> but they made it for me. It was good. I don't know what she did to it. I'm going to have to find out. It was good. So, I found out that, yeah, one, I was, I was kind of a snob. But I'm working on it. I didn't know that was happening. But it was great. I found that out. Um... I found out I like this candy. I guess you want to call it candy. It's like made with cereal and they got nuts in it. It's called Trash. I'm just saying that's what it's called. It's called Texas Trash. That's actually what it's called. It is sold here in, in Texas. Uh, you can get it online. But it's just like pretzels and like different types of Czech cereal. And it's got like um, almonds and pecans in it. It was so good. And it comes in a really cute packaging. I don't have any to show you because I don't eat it all. So I found out I like that. And I'm trying not to. And then also, I found out that I love candy. Y'all know that. But I found out that I can live without it. Just kind of stop eating candy. I'm kind of upset about that. But I have, like, I have candy in my mini refrigerator in my bedroom. I ain't even ate it. It's sad. But I found that out. And let me see what else. 
I found out I don't like change very much. Not big changes, like moving and I, I, I don't ever want to move. I don't, Next time I move, I'm moving from here to the grave. Yeah, quote me on that. I don't like to move. I don't like packing. I, I move my room around and all that stuff. <sighs> I'm not doing that no more. It, it's going to stay like that for life. Cause I'm not doing that no more. I don't, don't like that too much of a change. And I guess last but not least that I discovered about myself this year is that I am friendly. <laughs> I've been told um, by one of my good friends, yeah, Shannon, I'm talking about you, that I am way too friendly. Like, I walk in and meet the don't know nobody, you know, who work in the store or just patrons or whatever. And I end up walking out there with a friend um, to the point where we went had a real deep conversation. And we might exchange phone numbers, took a selfie together. It done got real. So, <laughs> I found out, yeah, they're like, I'm overly friendly. So, and that's interesting because at one point in time, people were telling me that, I, well, I was in my 20s. They told me I wasn't very friendly. And something must have happened between then and now, because I'm y'all know I'm 44 for a very short time till October. So I guess I decided to be friendly. I don't know. But I love people. You know, I really do. There's some really cool people out there. And there's some of y'all, y'all need to stop. But the rest of y'all, <laughs> y'all, y'all awesome. So hey, hit me up. Let me know uh, what you think about what I just shared with you. Share something with me. And if you want to know anything else, next time I guess I'll write it down instead of randomly hitting it. But that's basically it. Bye, subbies.